Hey you guys, welcome back to another video. If you're new here, please make sure to like and subscribe. Help support me. Make sure you don't miss another video, you know? You don't want to miss one. So, um, for today's video, I'm actually filming this introduction like in advance from when I'm going to film the actual video because I just kind of started prepping for this thing that I want to do and I figured I would make it into a YouTube video. And I'm like really like inspired right now, so I wanted to film this introduction. Um, so yeah, so today's video is going to be about creating a vision board for myself and then a little bit about like manifestation. Um, I'm still very, very um, new. I'm still learning so much about um, manifestation and um, visioning things that you really want in your life and being able to like um, bring those to the surface and like make it happen and so I really wanted to make a vision board of things that I want for myself and in my life uh, and so that I'm always reminded of them and because I am a very firm believer that if you want something bad enough you can absolutely have it uh, you just have to make sure that it's always, you know, in sight and that you have that goal that you're working towards. Um, you just have to work for it and sometimes you have to work harder for um, one thing than the other, but I really believe that everything on my vision board it are things that I will have. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to be making this vision board and it should be really fun. So right now I'm just, I just have been, I just kind of wrote it out on this sheet. And now I'm kind of going through and finding like pictures and images that represent each one. And then in a couple days, I'm probably gonna go to the store and get like a cork board or something where I can either like glue or like tack them onto and kind of make a cool like aesthetic board that I can hang in my room so that I see it every single day. So. I thought I would bring you guys along with me for this so that I can kind of talk about um, my thought process on this, what my visions are and like how I'm doing this to maybe inspire you guys to do the same because um, I know that this is becoming a bigger thing and I, I think that's amazing. I think it should become a bigger thing because it really is real. Like if you really want something in your life, I mean you can have it and so many people don't think that that's a real thing but really like honestly if you set your mind the right way and if you work hard enough for it like you're gonna get it and that is something that is like incredible to me like blows my mind and it just excites me so much for the things that I can have in the future so if you guys are interested in seeing my vision board and learning a little bit about that make sure to keep watching good morning it's um many days later from the first part of this video but i have the day off so i am going to make the board today i have to go to the store first and get some things i think i might just go to dollar tree um dollar tree is underrated i literally love shopping at the dollar tree because there's so many like cute and like fun things you can find there and they're so cheap but um, I'm gonna run to the Dollar Tree today with Mal and then come back here and we're gonna set it up. Um, I actually recorded a whole clip the other day of me like drawing out the pictures that I wanted to put on the board because I didn't have a printer. But we scratched that because Mallory has a printer which came in clutch, thanks Mal, and she's gonna print off the, um, the Word document that I had originally for me and then um, we're gonna put it all together today so happy friday it is literally a beautiful fall 
day today. It's chilly and I don't have to work and I'm so happy and in such a good mood. So this should be a good day. So um, stay tuned. Fun thing. I think this black will go good with the black and white um, pictures. So let's get crafty. explained what I was actually doing here. So let me tell you what I'm putting on my board. Since you know. Alright, so the first thing that I'm putting on here is the 1000 YouTube subscribers. Um, I have 49 right now. But can I start somewhere? We're gonna do that. Um, then the next thing is 5,000 Instagram followers. I definitely want more, but... Oh shoot, the picture I printed out says 10. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> I definitely want way more, but like, I believe in making small goals to get to that bigger goal. And like saying, putting like a million followers on here is just not something that's like probably gonna happen anytime soon. And that can be very discouraging if you make a giant goal with a short period of time behind it because you're probably like it's not likely that's gonna happen but you know so we're starting with 5,000 maybe 10,000 somewhere there just more than I have now I have like almost 2,000 right now the next thing I have on here is um, Grace P Fit Studios don't ask me what it's gonna be because I'm not sure but I was telling Mallory today that I'm going to buy this little commercial space downtown that's for sale right now, but um, I can't afford that. But one day I will be able to afford that, and when I get there, then I'll tell you what I'm going to put in it, but I don't know. But it's going to be called Grace P. Fit Studios, and we're going to do something fun there. The thing going off of that is make Grace P. Fit my full-time job. Um, that's the end goal. That's basically what we're working towards right now. That's what I'm going to school for. So that kind of has to happen. So that's on the board. Next is graduate ASU, I'm starting there next semester. Hopefully gonna graduate in the same amount of time that I would have if I stayed in school this semester, but um, this will be the third college I've gone to. So let's just, we're just shooting to graduate from this one. We're gonna get there. <laughs> Um, after that is no student loans. I really want to be able to pay off all my student loans before I have to start making payments on them, which will be like six months after I graduate. Um, so I definitely think that is a very realistic goal and I can make that happen. Um, next thing I have is build my dream house. I have a random picture of a house on here that I liked, but I don't really know exactly what that looks like yet. I just know that like, I want to have that financial freedom to just be able to live in a house that is mine and that is everything that I want. And going off of that is travel. Everywhere I can promise you 100% that I'll be traveling. Um, 
hopefully everywhere that I want to. We'll see. But that's a promise. So that's on there because that's happening. Um, the next thing is I probably should have just put dream car because this is probably going to change. But I really want a white Jeep Wrangler. Um, it's very trendy right now, but I really like them. And so I put a picture of that on there because I will not be driving my little black car for the rest of my life, even though she's great for right now. And then the last thing I put on here is move out of Wisconsin for a little bit. Um, I don't know where that is. I don't know when that is, but I've lived in Wisconsin my entire life and I definitely want to see things other than snow for eight months of the year. So we're gonna move and um, experience new things. And yeah, those are the things that I'm putting on this vision board that I'm gonna hang in my room um, and that I'm gonna manifest because every single one of these things on here is gonna happen. Um, just gotta work for it, just gotta believe in it. And now we're gonna make it pretty and put it on my wall. Alright, so it's a little bit all over the place right now, but this is what it looks like while all this is drying, and then I'm gonna like clean it up a little bit, and then I'll show you the final picture, but I'm not artistic, and this is pretty good for me, so just be nice. Let me show you the final product. So, here she is. So, I love it. Um, oh my god, I just got glitter all over. So, the purpose of having this is just because I'm in a stage in my life right now where there is a lot of opportunity. And um, especially not going to school, I have a lot of extra time when I'm not at work to kind of just... Um, figure everything out for myself and work on my business and work on me and um, my parents have really been preaching to me for a while about like manifestation and changing your mindset and I am finally starting to listen to them sorry mom and dad took so long but um, there is a couple of books there there are a couple of books that I'm going to be reading and or that I'm gonna keep reading and finish that are about manifestation and I'm gonna hang this in my room. And the key really is to just set your mind to it and work every single day for it. Do something um, big or small every day that's gonna put you in the right direction. Um, but yeah, I mean, I know most of these are materialistic things kind of, but, well, not really, I just, um, there is a certain life that I picture for myself right now, and I know it'll change, but the bigger picture is something that I imagine staying the same for me, and I just want to be able to be productive towards that every single day, and I think having this as a reminder will really help me get there, because it is hard some days to, um, you know, work at it and um be productive especially after working a long shift but i know that if i do this now and i work really hard that it's gonna pay off eventually and um this just really excites me having this and looking at it um because i know like i know in my heart that um i can and i'm going to have every single one of these things and that just is so exciting to me because the fact that you can do whatever in this life is just it's it's a big realization and um 
yeah, I really encourage you guys to do this um, as well with some goals and dreams that you have because I really truly believe that if you set your mind to something and you work hard for it, you're gonna get it. So I don't know, maybe sit down and think about it. Maybe make a board like this, maybe just write it down, whatever you want. I just hope this video inspired you and maybe um, sparked a little interest in you in manifestation and changing your mindset for the better. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Um, if you did, please make sure to like and subscribe as always. It really helps to support me and um, that way you won't miss any more of my videos. I post every Tuesday at 11, so I hope to see you guys here again next week.